What's up you guys, Bar Muffet 300 back here with another episode of Engineer's Life. And today is the day where we will complete the Stone Age. So, without saying anything much more, let's get right into it. So we I'm all and I'm here with uh my friend Blackbeard Skulls, as always. Hello. And go ahead and check him out on his twitch and so we explored a bit to get some resources and we found these saking rows don't look at the farm and don't look at i said don't look at it okay really <laughs> so if you stand over it as you can see it gives you regeneration so i thought uh we would grab those and put a couple of them next to our house and you'll also notice that we only had one seed. Um, like last time. But, the way I got so many was, if you go into the quest, you'll notice that, uh, which one? Which one gave us a coin? A bunch of them. Uh, I think it was in tools and armor. Uh, one of the quests, okay, so one of the quests I know gives you a, um, a stone coin. If you come all the way down in the quest lines to reward zone, you can buy stuff with your stone um, coins. So you can buy either a stack of clay, a stack of wood, a stack of string, and I chose to buy a stack of bone meal, and then that's how... I got a bunch of crops and what we needed the wheat for was not only breeding our cows but we also needed it to get off this next quest which will take these because you need three hay bales two oak leaves and a slab and what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead put your these up there and your hay bales on the bottom and you will get a bed of straw and leaves and this is a once time place that I'm guessing you place down your bed is what you do so we got that one you will get a bed compass because it's not expecting to have these beds so this would be your first bed that it will place down and then you would use this bed compass to because you can't break it. So you'd have to use your bed compass to go and find your bed. And that's what that is for. So. Once we have that. We can just throw that back in there. And. Next up. Will be. The sleeping bag. Now to get the sleeping bag. You do need blue carpet. You may be asking yourself. Well how do I get blue dye in this? Well, in order to get blue wool, you need your new blue dye. As you can see, there's either lapis or this blue dye. How you get this blue dye is, if you find a mine, you will find these roots. And if you find a root with a little blue circle in it, that's what you want to mine. It'll give you this blue sprout, which you can turn into the blue dye. So, we will come back to that. But as, um, come back, we need to make all this tanned leather. Which is why you see I put, I made an armor stand, put up our old armor here. Because we are going to take all this leather that I uh, dried before the start of this episode. Because we went out venturing, killed a lot of cows. And we got, I got a bunch of tanned leather. Enough for both of us to have full sets of armor. So go ahead and make those. Two chest plates, two He's helmets. One armor stand. And there's the boots. So now we have, we are now combat ready. Now look at how much that gives you. That gives you three and a half plus two toughness. 
which was better than the stone armor. Here you go, Blackbeard. Blackbeard. There you go. So, now that we got all that armor, we can go ahead and accept that quest. I'm just going to make my own armor stand because people don't make it for you. What armor do you have to put on there? It's not the point, okay? It's not the point. Okay. Um, it is to make it for everybody. So, next up will be our way to the coke oven and eventually completing this. So, we will next be getting a basic charcoal production here. So, you're going to need dirt, these sticks here, and a wooden pile. Now... We will go ahead and to make a wooden pile, all you need is oak logs. So, and you craft them in a two by two, just together, like you would a crafting table with just oak planks. And you'll get wood piles. So we'll go ahead and get that. Now the reason why it says you need dirt is because how what we're basically going to do here is make a charcoal pit. Now, just put your charcoal in the pieces. And And we need one more charcoal piece here. Do we have one more charcoal piece? No, we don't. That's okay. Um, so we'll go ahead. So basically what you want to do. Is we're going to make a charcoal pit. So. We're gonna put down the wood. Let's do a little four by four here. And you wanna make sure you cover up all the sides here with dirt. And then we'll cover the top. And you want to leave one spot open, and this is where we're going to set it on fire. So, what we will do, we will take our sticks, we will set this log on fire, and cover it with dirt. Now, if it's working right, you will see smoke particles coming out from the dirt. And eventually, it is going to spread and move to the other logs and you will see more particles from the other see we got one here now and it's just gonna spread and over time it's gonna completely fill up and you will know that it's done cooking the charcoal once these particles are gone so we'll come back to that in a bit to check on that so next up is we do get to claim this quest. You will get a trick or treat bag and a chance cube. Now, these chance cubes are very dangerous. Eh, not really. And I highly recommend not opening them. Oh, I do. But I because this is a stream, we are gonna open them for the fun of it. Don't know what this does. Um. Not gonna do that. But Blackbeard, where are you? Um. Did you come to the ask, house? I don't ask where I'm at. It's in a bad place. And we right can now. open up these chance cubes. Why don't you open up your chance cube? You want me to open up my chance cube? Yeah, I always open up chance cubes. Yeah, but we we could open them together, side by side. If you see where I'm at, you know I'm doing something that I shouldn't be. All you gotta do is look at the map. Just come back to me. All you gotta do is look at the map. Mm -hmm. Is he still out here? I don't see you on the map. Please. So you said we can't kill these old dudes? What little dude? Yeah. Oh my god, you went to the Woodland Mansion, didn't you? I did. You're gonna get destroyed.
They can't get up to Oh, I killed one! Uh huh. Oh, I did. I believe you. He was, tra he was trapped in the grass. They're not that hard to kill. Okay. All right, so while we wait on our charcoal, as you can see, it says put it into pieces because that will be more fuel efficient. We'll go ahead and get our 27 coke brick. For coke brick, you're gonna need um, you're gonna need concrete and bricks. Also with the blocks of charcoal, that's why I recommend. That's why it has you do the charcoal first, so you get the charcoal cooking, and then you can craft this. So. For the bricks, it's just regular bricks, which is just clay smelted up. And the concrete is going to be sand, clay, and gravel. So once I get all the necessary parts, we'll go ahead and come back and craft it. Okay, and here we go. We are now going to open up our chance cubes that Blackbeard has joined us. Blackbeard? Oh, what did that do? Oh, I have a half a heart. Oh. <laughs> No, <laughs> it gave you half a heart. Yeah, it gave me half a heart. That was. That open up mine. Uh, yeah, right there under the tree. Away from me, though. Holy shit, I got no health. Uh. Do it. You're Do it. it. Shield. Oh no! I heard a gas noise. Really? Is there gas? Is there gas above us? I don't, know. I don't see it. You hear it though, right? I hear it, but I don't see him. I don't got the hell for this, so you're on your own. <laughs> yeah, you're on your own, buddy. I think the nice spawn him underground. Just, I don't know if he spawned him underground. He might. I don't see a. Wait, hold on. Let me see if I can show him. My... I, I, I think show he might you. be underground. Yeah, you could show mob icons. No, there's, there's a. He's not. There's not. I think it's the mob noise. I think it's the noise of it just to freak you out. Oh. You recording this? You recording this? Hey, look at me. Hey! Is that necessary? I thought I'd go higher, so that's. that's I'm not putting it in. <laughs> Excuse you? Uh, no. Okay, so yes. As you can see, we did get the sleeping bag. Um. Not Blackbeard only because me. when Blackbeard was off, he actually went to the Woodland Mansion. There was blue carpet there. So he hurry up, hopped in, grabbed blue carpet. I and sacrificed my life. So we could get the sleeping bag. You will so get, get the bag. bush tea. And now our brick should be done smelting, except for this one little piece. And we can make the coke oven so you will need five recipes of the concrete which is just sand gravel and clay with a water bucket and you will need to do four recipes uh, of the um or you will need uh two stacks and 16 uh clay to smell into bricks and we'll do this right now we'll get those bricks and so you should have 36 and 40 now all we're waiting on is the charcoal, which you can tell is not done because you can hear the fire particles and you can also see the smoke. So we will zoom as soon as it's done. All right, we are back and as you can see, no more smart smoke particles and no more of the fire sound. So if you want to, if you go ahead and remove this dirt. You'll see that you get ash blocks. So go ahead and remove it. As you see, all these are ash blocks. And when you break the ash blocks, it will give you ash and charcoal. So you'll go ahead and break that. Breaks just like sand. And we have one, two, three, four stacks of charcoal and some ash from forestry. So. We do with this charcoal is we will go ahead and and create some of them into the locks. Let's 
So now we can go ahead and make the coke brick. So you will want 27 of these. And boom, perfect. And now we have the coke oven. We go ahead and do this. And we will go ahead and throw eight charcoal in here. We get that 64. You can go ahead and throw those in there. So now that we have all of that. So this we'll get a food bag. We'll get a beetroot and a poisonous potato. And what you want to do is when you complete this, you will get engineer's manual, a hammer, and a stone coin. You always be getting that money. And you can go ahead and read through the manual. This will tell you everything about machines, tools. This will be mostly used uh, for later on. So you can go ahead and watch that. But we did make this room over here for a reason. So we'll come in here. I will place. It is a 3x3. Three three. And a 3x3x3 three by three by three, I should say. Just stack that up. Collect these torches. And lay this last layer. And now, to fully finish it and complete it, you want to take your hammer, right click right in the center, and boom, turns into a Coke oven. So if you right click on it, you will notice that there is a sl small slot here. Which is where you're gonna put coal. Out, it's gonna output to coal coke, and in this empty tank, it's gonna give you creosote oil, which is what we're gonna need for the next quest. In the next quest, you can see it's gonna ask for treated wood. Treated wood you get from crafting cre creosote oil surrounded by wood. So that is exactly what we're gonna do. So what I like to do is to get a big batch of it. So what I will do is I will take the coal we have unfortunately charcoal does not work we will make these into blocks and we'll go ahead and if this door will let me through we will go ahead and put the coal in there now this is going to take longer than if it was just regular coal as you can see this is slowly going to go down and then get its creosote oil it is going to take a while, so I'll be right back when it's done. All right, and we're back, and as you can see, the block of coal is almost melted. It'll turn into the coal coke. You want to take your bucket, put it in here, wait for the creosote oil to go in, and we should get our bucket of creosote oil pretty soon. It, the flame is... There we go. As you can see, we got the block of cold coke, the creosote oil, and our buckets. Now, what you want to do is you want to take this bucket. You want to go ahead and get your wood planks. You want to go ahead and surround like you're making a chest. You want to put that creosote oil bucket right in the middle. You can take that out. We'll go ahead and get another bucket here because we are going to need a few of treated wood go ahead and put that in there and we'll do this a couple more times there there and almost done come back here get that and looks like this will be the last bucket of this block and there we go so now what you want to do is it's going to have you make a couple stuff from uh immersive engineering one of those things is going to be sticks which is just the normal crafting recipe boom and another is a crate now for the crate 
what you want to do here is wooden storage crate it's, it's just going to be your regular planks like crafting a chest but the difference between these storage crates and a chest is what for this challenge is that when you place it down you don't need a spot above it to open you can just open it if there's a spot covering the top and another cool part about these things is it will keep its inventory so if I throw the tree to wood in there then I break it nothing drops it keeps its inventory so if I place it down boom still has the planks in it so these are very good for moving around stuff um, like that so we'll just go ahead and put this right over there and I usually like to keep all my tree to win that you will get a loot chest now the version we're playing in does not allow us to you have to take off your oh um, does not allow us to open these um, it will give us an error so I can go ahead and throw that to Blackbeard um, I, just throw, I, just, I just delete it so next up is a wooden barrel which will just take slabs and planks so what we can do is throw the sticks in there get some slabs throw the slabs on top surround the rest with the wood and boom we got a barrel I think this is just another way of storage really oh wait this is to hold fluid this is why uh, the barrel is just to hold fluid so if you want to hold certain fluid go ahead and put it in there so we'll just go ahead and put all our immersive engineering inside that crate now for this challenge you will get a potion of high step so this is pushing which I don't know and you'll also get a stone coin so we'll go ahead and take that and that will be the completion of the stone age so if you go ahead and look at our quest book we now have the mechanical age unlocked along with a couple other stuff we do have um, complete stone age we do get a stone coin for that so we'll go ahead and take that stone coin for the completion of the stone age now with that unlocked you can go ahead now we have aesthetics so a bunch of different blocks um, basically to make your base look really sweet uh, we will be getting into this uh, we'll definitely be doing some of this making our updating our house that will probably be in the near future of episodes also if you look at the quest book you can now see that the there is a bronze tier reward now I'm wondering if you can take the stone coins can you craft them? Doesn't look like it. No, it does not look like it. So but you're better off just eight, buying. Better off just buying all the stuff that you can that's worth the stone coins because you can only complete it once. So there's that. And with the completion of that stone age, I think that is gonna be it for us today. We got a couple stuff done. Got the charcoal pit we got the coke oven and we have finally completed the stone age next episode we will be moving on to the mechanical age which we already have the creosote and the hemp so i will see you guys in the next one peace